Bree from mummyofboard.com and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a little shop with me, in fact shop with my whole family for you, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new here, welcome, please subscribe, hit the bell to be notified when I post new videos every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday at 7pm. I do lots of shop with me, more as well as hunting, tips, tricks, hacks and advice, speed cleans, all that kind of good stuff. Anyway, should we go shopping, Zaza? Yeah. Which shop do you want to go to first? Uh, Shop. The Disney shop. I think that's a bit of a popular one. I think we will head there pretty soon. I don't know about you, but I always find when shopping with children and husbands, it's a delicate balance between letting them do what they want to do early enough for the trip and leaving something as like a carrot to dangle. But if they're good, we can do that at the end. Ah, oh, frozen toys. That's so exciting. Frozen toys. And these are all from Frozen 2. That's a, what a pretty Anna dress. Wow. And look, sandwiches in Anna's travel bag. Mommy, the new outfit on the costume. Oh, wow. You've been desperate to look at those. Oh, I want to buy one of Oh, new Frozen dollies. You need to start thinking, guys, about what you're going to ask Father Christmas sure, for. Not sure. Oh, it's very exciting. Ooh, they are lovely, aren't they? Look. You want to look at the costumes, don't you? Look at this. Look. Zara, look. This is a new Elsa dress. Yes. Elsa Lego. Elsa Lego. Elsa Lego. Wow. What are you looking for, Zara? Jasmine stuff. Okay, we'll go look for Jasmine stuff. <gasps> Is that Jasmine stuff? Oh, wow. Which dress do you like? You like that white dress? It's so beautiful. Maybe we should ask Father Christmas for one. What do you think? No? Yeah. Yeah, maybe Father Christmas could bring you one? Oh look, more jasmine, Zara. Look. Wow. Oh yeah. Wow. Oh, Zara's already got Doc McStuffins. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yes. Oh, that is jasmine. Wow. Oh, wow. It's so exciting. Okay. Oh, I think you've got those dollies. I do. Oh, okay. So you don't have that one or that one or that one? You haven't got one draft? Oh. You don't have a one dolly? She's so beautiful. She's beautiful. One of those, the beast. Bella's got the beast. Maybe Bella will lend you her beast. No, my own beast. You want your own beast? <laughs> You're not even that fast on the beast. Keep my beast. Oh, look, Sarah. Sally. Oh, he's huge. He's a You've got a Sally. He's not quite that big. Smooth it, look. Look, he's almost as big as you. Oh, he's, huge. he's lovely. Look who I can see. Cuddly Moana and Cuddly Jasmine. Look. Look, Jasmine. Um, Mummy. Mummy. Because a minute ago you wanted a wonder. Sure, I know it's a very difficult choice to make, isn't it? Jasmine, I'm a You'd like a game? Well, yeah. bear in mind, before you spend your money, we're going to the Lego shop, we're going to the Hamley's toy okay. shop. There's so many shops to choose from. A soft one. So Zara, you could have this one or you could have the Wonder Dolly from over there. Which would you prefer, Jasmine or Wonder? Look, Mummy! You have got a Jasmine Dolly at home, but not a cuddly one. Which one do you like, darling? Or do you want to have a think and say spend your money later? Um, that one. I'm spend it now. You want to pay for her. Um, so you're thinking you might want Tiana from Princess and the Frog. Let me see her. She's very beautiful. She's got a very pretty green dress. Are you sure? 
think you've got yeah, yeah. one. That's what you guys want to buy, is it? And then we'll go and have some lunch. Yeah, then then when we go to the Lego shop, can I buy some Lego? Well, we'll see how much money you've got left. We'll have to have a look. Okay. Should we go and pay? Yeah. Come on then. Well, have you seen anything you'd like? Yeah. You're a lot more thoughtful and careful with your money, aren't you? Wait a I usually save smell. it till we've looked at all the Well, William, that's a very sensible way to shop, you know. I am loving all of this beautiful Christmas stuff too. I want all of it, that's the problem. Zara, look at these Toy Story toys. They're so lovely, aren't they? Wow, they've got all the figures from Toy Story 4. Wow, you're going to have to think of lots of these things to put on your Christmas list for Father Christmas and your birthday just afterwards. No way. Forky. Oh. And a Forky, I made a Forky. Forky, Forky. You love Forky, don't you? And look, look at Bo Peep. Bella. She's lovely. You've got to start thinking what you're going to ask Father Christmas for and what you want to ask for your birthday. Because your birthday's just after Christmas. And your birthday's only six weeks after Christmas. You're going to press the button? We have got a buzz light here at home, haven't we? So I don't think we need a buzz. So what do you think? How, are you starting to make notes? Or we think, right, what I'm going to write on my Christmas list? Yeah. And your birthday? Yeah. So many decisions. I know Christmas is coming very quickly, but I really want to take the girls dressed up to go and watch the new Frozen film. So I'm going to see what they think about maybe having these costumes to wear to the film. Girls, girls, you know when we go and watch Frozen in the cinema, would you like to go dressed as Anna? And would you like to go dressed as Elsa? What do you think? You want a frozen fever dress? But they don't sell those anymore. But this is what Anna will be wearing in the film. Do you like that? Would you like to go to the film dressed in that? To go and watch Frozen. I'm sure you could. What do you think, Bella? Does this fit you? Yeah. Come here, come around here to see if this fits you. Well, I think that would fit you beautifully. Would you like to wear that to go and yeah. see Frozen? Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. And Zara, they don't have a Frozen Fever costume here, so I thought maybe we'd ask Father Christmas to bring you one of those. But step off the ride on board for Mummy. Does that fit you? Would that look beautiful on you? Shall Mummy buy those for you? So when we go see Frozen 2 in the cinema, you can wear that. So you will be who? Yeah. Well, Anna <laughs> and Bella be Elsa, yeah? Good plan. Oh, loving the Minnie Mouse Halloween ears. They are super cool. Don't you think? And look, Sarah, you've got stickers. What do you say? Thank you. Thank you very much. That was lots of fun, but kind of chaotic. And now we're all boiling hot pretty hungry so we're gonna go and grab some lunch before we do some more shopping. Zara, what have you done with your stickers? Show mummy. You put them on your arm straight away. One on each arm. Such a good look. You saving your stickers? Very sensible. We've just stopped for a bit of lunch. Zara is too hungry to actually wait for her lunch properly. She's got some Frozen, because even colouring wouldn't keep you happy. And my big thing is looking forward to doing some more shopping. We've had some lunch, which was lovely. And now Sarah's been to the toilet. And now I face the biggest challenge that any parent on the face is on a day out. We're just trying to get them to nap when it's totally exciting and interesting and they don't want to sleep. So wish me luck. Zara, are you going to be a good girl and go to sleep for mummy? Okay, are you going to be a good girl and go to sleep? I don't know. Place your bets in the comments. Will she go to sleep? I'm keeping everything calm. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Please? No. Still no luck so far. Zara going to sleep. She's still wide awake. But I 
thought, while I've got to walk round and round trying to get to sleep, I may as well walk round and round with John Lewis. Because <laughs> the others are with my husband. This would be my opportunity to look up. I want to look up for two minutes. Love, love, love children's clothes. This is cute. This would look lovely on the girls. Do you like that? Cat kids in section. Yeah, in general. And in fact, Clara has this very bag. But she's not. For school, she has that bag. Oh, that already. Oh, and look, in fact, the girls are wearing this. Today. I just wish, I mean, it's very similar to mine. I just wish mine had the sparkly stars on it. That's a shame. That's they don't make them for adults like that. <gasps> love this. Love this. Love, love, love. The dinosaurs. So gorgeous. Also, I am so sad that the girls have grown out of this stuff because I used to love this brand when they were little, tiny, tiny. It goes up to, I don't know, maybe each two. So it's proper, you know, gorgeous. New white sock colour section. Makes my ovaries hurt a little bit, but I can't dress them in that anymore. And in fact, I used to dress the boys when they were little in very similar, you know, the baby blue version. No more babies for me. <laughs> the impossible has happened. <laughs> Winning in life. Winning in life. Now they don't have them in the right size for the girls, but how cute are these? They're kind of uniformly wellies. Might have to order this online because I haven't got the right size here, but oh, how cute. And I haven't had a look at one of these yet. I've got an iPhone 10, I think. So iPhone 11, an 11 Pro. I would like one, whether I can warrant an upgrade at the moment. And maybe warrant it for work, it's like totally for work. I mean, it looks like they've a camera or something. But, uh, these are so. Although I must say, if I am buying tech and gadgets and things, I do tend to get them from John Lewis for me or for family members or anything because they do have an extended warranty that they offer up, up, sort of above and beyond other places you can buy from and they do price match as well. So this is not an ad. I'm just telling you what I do. I do John Lewis does tend to be doing it too. Well, I've spoken to my eldest son who's with my husband and they've just been, they're just dead up on the top floor of John Lewis where I was and I come downstairs in the lift. I'm not going back up. So instead, I'm going to go and have a wander around Cat Kidston. Now, with a legitimate reason, I do need a present for my mother-in-law and she loves all things Cat Kidston, as do I. So this should be fun. Ready, sat and roasting. Now, if you haven't yet caught my um, school bag haul, which I will link up on cards now, you will not know my children have a lot of these bags. Okay, we've got a large one. We've got this one here. This school bag. Very good. This one's got. Very good. Ah, so I've got this one as a bottom jumper. Um, I can't even find those. But anyway, go and check out that video after you've seen this one uh, to see all the lovely cafes and goodies and stationery and stuff that they have to store. So, I'm struggling to choose a present, mainly because there's so much choice and partly because I've ordered some cafes and pretty much Christmas and birthday every year forever. But I am kind of liking this cafe dressing gown. I think it's just gorgeous. 75, one size. You can get size wrong. I go for it. It's gorgeous. I think she'd like it. She's a little bit shorter than me and it is quite long. So, what do you think? Oh, I'm going to bag on. 
which takes too long. I don't know. Or more shopping bags. Do we ever have enough cat kids in shopping bags? Probably not. Now maybe I'm thinking, maybe I can have one of these, which is rather nice. And, you know, I love maybe. I feel like maybe this a lot. And she thought, she thought, she's got other handbags, she's got other cat kids in handbags, but she hasn't got one like this. What do I do? I have phoned my husband, he's like, I don't know. I'm in the same shelf, I don't know, it's all up to you. I can't tackle down, thank you. Just hold on to me. Crash it on. Her name is Margaret. And actually, a lot of people call her M. So, that's a good like add on for whatever I decide to fit in, to buy with it. Yeah. So this one is rather beautiful. And I don't know what to do now. Paralysis by analysis. I'm so excited at the best of times. Blame being a Libra. I don't know what to buy. But one Christmas, one birthday. What's that silly? I've made my purchases. I've also made a little impulse purchase of look. I'm hoping that that smells as delicious as it sounds. And um, I was asked if I need a bag, but I clearly do not need any bags because on my pram I always have a selection of these cactus and bags which are my favourite hooked on with a carabiner I literally can I'll link these carabiners below because you can't be without them if you've got a pram and in fact you can't be without them if you've got shopping bags because I use those to hook them on the back of my headrest in the boot of the car super super handy to keep them together and I actually remember to bring my pretty shopping bags then which is always better so yeah made my purchase I shall show you later in my haul section of my video what I actually went for so make sure you stay tuned to the end Noticed if you've been following me since last winter that I'm kind of obsessed with these jumpers. They're starting to creep back in again now. I have them in all the colours. So obviously I'm in here just seeing if there are any colours I don't have. I do not need any more. Someone please stop me. I just, they're so good and they're so versatile. I just want all the colours, okay? Just, but someone could stop me, seriously. <laughs> You know that I love, love, love Jojo Star for, well, used to be for Will, now he's grown out of it, and Heartbreak City. This is probably the last season I can get away with dressing Zara and Bella and anything matching because they even go up to each five to flip. It's all so beautiful. Uh, but if you buy anything from Jojo, these tights are brilliant. I will link these below. Um, but they're really good quality tights and they've got the grippy bits on the bottom of the sole that they come in trillions of colours um, so if you're looking for a specific colour tights to go with something from Jojo or from somewhere else it's a really really good bet and they wash fantastically I've got lots of pairs of tights that were Bella's and there's ours and they still look like new so top tip there another really good bargain thing here are their wellies really really great a lot of um, Bella's wellies I've hang on to for Zara and again they're still like new just have them in all sorts of colours my girls always prefer wearing wellies to anything else I think just because they're easy to get it on and off but if they match their outfits, they look kind of cool anyway. In fact, tutus and wellies are my girl's favourite look, I think. I'm loving these. Oh, they're so cool. And oh, sort of pony unicorn, unicorn ones too. Father Christmas. I might send him a little note and ask him to bring some of those the stocking fellas. They are cool. And if you've got a newborn, or a small baby and you are wondering what to ask Father Christmas to bring just like bits like this make really good stocking fillers for newborn babies because newborn babies are not that fussed on a lot of stuff but think about even if they're not at that stage yet weaning accessories things like that really good stocking fillers you can use them before you know it it's just more to unwrap and then you can film it all and show them the following year to explain what Christmas is all about so sweet that's what I did anyway more firm favourites these packaways uh, waterproofs I do keep these in the car boot all year round just in case we get caught without a coat they also have these packaways for forest school uh, for when they do outdoor learning things in school <gasps> love 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 this <gasps> love it do they have it oh no I might have to order it in see that's got the 45 so they do that in a 5 to 6 fella that's super cute for girls 
and they don't have Zara size either. She's needed two to three. <gasps> so cute. Adorable. My husband has just gone to have his phone fixed in the Apple shop and I have got my little two back with me. So we're going to go to a shop that I don't think you can remember having been to before called Hamley's and it's a big, big, big toy shop. Should we go and have a look? Yeah! Are you waking up, baby? Oh, do you want to sit up a bit? No? Okay, you say that. Look. Oh, look, Baby Shark Play-Doh. Oh, baby Shark do 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 Toy Story 4 Lego. There's 20% off Lego Friends. But you have got a watch because you're wearing one. You want to sit up? Mummy, get you up. Well, Bella, these are Sylvanian families. Mummy used to have loads of these when she was little. I had one. You had a ballet dancer one yeah, for your last birthday, one. didn't you? Can I have another one, please? You need one. You need one, do you? Yeah, I have another one. I don't think you need another one right now, but you can think of what you might want to ask for for your Christmas and birthday because it's coming up. Not now, but you could ask for it for Christmas or birthday. I know, it's a, it's a hard lesson, isn't it? It's very tough. But we have got to start thinking about what you might want to ask for for Christmas. And your birthday is a couple of days after Christmas. I have to find something in here. I know, darling, but you're not going to, you're going to run out of money. No, darling, you don't need that, but you could ask for it for Christmas if you really want it. Which Lego do you want to look at, Miss? Okay, you lead the way. That's the Lego Friends, is it? Yeah, that's the Lego Well, what, are you, what have you got your eye on? And is it something you want to buy now or something you're going to ask for for Christmas? You quite like that, do you? Okay. Thousands of bricks, okay. The Queen, Queen whatever a wannabes set. Is that something that you, you're after? You have got enough of your own money to buy that if you want to. What is it, Angel? Shall I get you out? What, darling? You want to go and play the Duke Flow? Okay, we're going to play Duke Flow. Well, what have you chosen? A triple decker couch. A triple decker what? Couch. Wow. That's amazing. And you've chosen that. Okay, well let's let's go and play some Duke Flow and then we'll take you to pay, okay? Who would like a little drink? Well, luckily, under here, which attaches onto the pram, I know, Bella, we've got a little oh, yeah. some picnic essentials. See how cool is that? Attaches on the pram. That was sent to me when we had the pram. Stop for a little drink and snack, haven't we, guys? Bella, show everyone how do we hold the carton? With hands. That's right. Now, as the children have been very good shopping, we have promised them around. We're going to have some fun play golf, Will. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Well, you've been on about golf all day, haven't you? Yeah, all day. Do you like the golf? It's so much fun, isn't it? Yeah. No one's getting you, no, darling. I told you you'd be quite yeah, safe. Try again, Bella. <laughs> Darling, I fear you get your golfing skills from Mummy. Me, Mummy. Of course I'll help you if you'd like me to help you. I will always help you. I'm not very good, but I'll do my best. We are now back in the car. Everyone's exhausted, we've had a lovely day. So I managed 15 of the 18 holes and then totally lost the pot. Anyway, glad to be home. When we get there, hopefully the traffic won't be too bad. Home now and I'm very quickly gonna show you what we have bought because it is quite late now and the children have hit the witching hour. <laughs> We've hit the witching hour. So I'm going to show you very quickly what we have bought. Right, in the Disney shop, Zara had a Princess Jasmine and Bella had 
a Tiana from The Princess and the Frog. And then the costumes, yes. <gasps> Bella has had this. Now this is because I wanted them to dress up. On. You could do it in a second if you want, darling. We'll try that on you in a second. Um, you can I put it can. over your dress. Put it over your dress I you're can, wearing. I you can, can do it. Perhaps William can help you. I can do it on my own. <laughs> so I wanted to dress them up oh, yeah. to go and see the stuff. new Frozen Mommy, film. I want them to, I have, they love Frozen so much. Yes, you can put it over too. Um, they love Frozen so much. I want to take them. We can put them over now with one hand. Well, we can do it with one hand, surely. What was I even saying? I want to take them to see the new Frozen film on the day it opens, dressed up. So this is why I've got these. And honestly, I know these, these were not cheap as, as um, dressing up costumes go, but they seem lovely quality. And they'll just wear them and wear them, wear them. They wear them around the house, they wear them to parties. Um, you know, they'll just wear them and wear them, won't they? Come here, baby. Oh my goodness, Zara, can I have a twirl please? A twirl. And this is so gorgeous. This has even got a hooped petticoat under it. So really pleased with that. You look amazing as Princess Anna from Frozen 2. And Bella, look at you as Elsa. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So pleased with those. What do you think? What do you think? And for some, for some reason, William, you did not want an Olaf one, did you? I did offer to buy you an Olaf costume though. Not first. I know! Right, should we show everyone else we bought? So, didn't buy loads, didn't buy as much as we wanted to buy in the Disney store, but we were looking for lots of ideas for what to ask Father Christmas for, and I think we've got lots of ideas now. So on now to what I bought in Kath Kitson, what I chose for my mother-in-law's birthday, and I got this beautiful bag, which I'm really pleased with, and this rather lovely notepad. Like I said, this is why I'm doing a super quick haul um, for you because they are really overtired and expect. Right, come here, girl. William, you show you show what you bought then. Oh, oh Zara's showing. William, would you like to show what you bought from the Lego shop? Lego Movie Emmett Triple Decker Couch, that, whatever that is. There we go. And Bella bought up her money. Frozen Two Lego. And that, that's pretty much it. That's what we bought. Um, other than, I forgot to show you from the Disney store actually, Mommy. the bag. Um, but yeah, that, that's a pretty Stop. much what we bought. Oh, and we had stickers as well. So yeah, that is, we didn't buy loads and loads and loads, um, but today was mostly about, so the, the whole reason we went was for my husband to go to the Apple store and get his phone fixed, which he did. So this was just kind of a bit of a fun day. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for joining me. If you have liked this video, please give it a massive thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe, hit the bell to be notified when I post new videos every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday at 7 p.m. My latest video is just over here and more shop with me and hauls are just down here. I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye.